So this is our typical morning. Um, I have tennis lessons in, at City Club, usually at 10 o'clock with some of my students. And my husband goes to work at the City Club. He's a sports and recreation director there. And I wanted to ask him his first reaction when he found out we were going to have a third child, but really his fifth child. Hi, babe. What happened to you? <laughs> There's traffic here in Manila, so uh, I'm trying to focus right now. Uh, yeah, when I found out that uh, we know we have a new baby coming, it was a big shock, uh, you know. But you know, being with Mafe, Yunnan, now Belasco, I've come to learn that life is one big mystery and one great journey, and we just accept things as they come. So you know, maybe we're not in the the position in life that we want to be financially to bring in a new baby to the world but, you know this is how we live whatever God wants to put in front of us we know that he's not going to put it in front of us unless he knows we can handle it so you know immediately we snapped into focus and the shock is still here even though she's about three months four months and uh, we're doing what we got to do, you know, and things are starting to fall into place for for the new baby. Actually, I changed the name to Shimmy instead <laughs> of Shimmer, but uh, I'm the only one that says that. <laughs> and, uh, you know, we're happy with the new developments and, uh, you know, it's just you got to have faith. And when you have faith, things start to fall into place like they are now. And uh, we're just going to go with the flow, stay positive keep all negative thoughts out of our minds and, and that's what's bringing positivity our way yep that's my preacher of a husband I couldn't um, see life without him so I'm really glad to have more kids I mean even though when I was young I wanted to have 12 kids um, I have four now and I'm about to have my fifth and I think I'm just gonna take each day as it comes but anyways, here's the kids, here's the troops. Say hi guys. Hi Nikki. Get a seatbelt on. How excited are you to have another sibling? 100. What's the first thing you're gonna do when you see the baby? My reaction is gonna be really happy and excited because my mom said she I'm gonna be her helper to take care of the baby. Do you want a boy or a girl? A girl. Because I'm the only girl in the family. How do you feel about having another sibling? Um well, I'm very excited, and um, I just can't wait till it comes out. What baby names do you have? Um, well, if it's a girl, it'll be... <laughs> wait, I forgot. <laughs> um, wait, do you need Nikki to say it? Um, if it's a girl, the name will be Martha, and if it's a boy, either Mark or John. Do you have any? <laughs> Do, you have... <laughs> Do you have any baby names in mind? Um, yes. If it's a boy, I'd say Noah, and if it's a girl, maybe Martha. Boy or girl? Hmm. At first, I was like, I, I just wanted a girl, but since lately we've been hanging out with Harlem. Um, I'm not sure if you saw him in the first video, but he was there. He's been changing my mind to want a boy, so I'm still deciding. But if I had to choose right now, I'd say a girl. How excited are you to have the baby? Um, very, very excited. What names do you have for the baby? If it's a boy, um, we'll name it Max and Jack. But if it's a girl, I'll name it Amy and Becca. 
Boy or girl? Boy. Sure? Yes. Why? Because when it grows, when it goes older, you will just have so much fun when I'm a teenager. So now we're about to Skype my uh, very close friend who I consider as an older sister to me. I grew up with her in Australia. Um, she pretty much inspired me and the family to do the vlog and uh, she is a big fan of YouTube, uh, YouTube vlogs. So she'll probably tell you a lot about what she uh, watches and why she thought that we would be fun to watch, I guess. It's Cola. Vlog number two. Yep. Yep, yep. And you're I'm part excited. of it. If you're the main I'm inspiration. Excited. So I'm really glad that you, um, that I was, I managed to convince you to uh, start these vlogs. <laughs> vlogs. <laughs> And you're gonna be you're gonna be like a a frequent visitor, right? A frequent guest. Yep. Because you're so inspiring over there. And then you're gonna show us the side of Australia. Yep. Have you been practicing your Australian Give me give me a word. Give me a Australian word. Like what? Yeah. Talk to me like you're Australian. Say home. 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 What else? What else? Mummy. Huh? Mummy. Me. Louder. <laughs> Hi. 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 Say hi, Nina. Say to Mike. Did Mike. Did you fly the plane yet? Hi, Mike. Hi. Are you guys at the TV club? Yeah. Yes. A second home.
Yeah, I just wanted to introduce you to our viewers, our inspiration. Love you. See ya. Miss you guys. Miss you too. Bye bye.